to us. <laughs> it's, uh, our topic is uh, chapter seven. The topic is uh, government and, uh, and uh, politics in the United States. And this is uh, this is uh, the there are uh, ten sections in chapter seven, and uh, now we have six persons. Actually, today only five persons. We we are in charge of different uh, sections, and the first one is Linda. So now let's Linda begin. Okay. Okay, I'll introduce to you uh, the chapter seven about uh, the suspicion of the strong government. Um, what role do Americans think their government should play in their life? How do American values affect how the United States government function? Oh, let, let me look at like page one. Uh, the American have the ideal of the free individual as American value. For this, American has been a deep suspicion of, the, of a strong government. They believe that strong government is regarded as dangerous to individual freedom. The suspicion of strong government goes back to the man who leads the Revolution, uh, American Revolution in 1776. This man believed the government of Great British wanted to discourage of the freedom and economic opportunity of American colonists by excessive taxes and other measures that would uh, benefit the British aristocracy and the monarchy. That's page two, move to page two, okay. Yeah. Uh, to ensure <coughs> the government individual freedom and safety, the national government is made of the three branches. Like this uh, government, the three branches. The legislative, the executive, and the judicials and the three branches. Okay, let's move the yeah, detail. The legislative branches is uh, made of, uh, it's, a, it's, called the, uh, it's a called a Congress, make laws. Uh, the Congress has two houses, the Senator and the House of Representatives. The senator has two senators from each state, which according to the size of its uh, population. The, the second one is the executive branch. Executive, executive branch is, uh, oh, like the senator, like the House of the Presentation, uh, Presentatives has 435 representatives divided among the 50 states by their populations. Yeah. Then the president and the chief executive has the executive branch, which has responsibility to carry out the law. The, the third is the judicial branch. It's a comprised of the supreme, uh, supreme court and the lower national court interrupt laws. This means uh, the legislative branch is a make a law. The second is yeah, executive, the carry to the law. The judicial branch is interpret the law. Yeah. The next page, yeah. American government of a check, the American government system of a check and the balance ensures that no branch abused is a power congress, and the president are the most powerful branches. The constitution gives each branch the power to stop another from acting alone. 
so far, the most Americans still believe in this system. It still has been able to meet the challenges of the past and give strong protection to individual freedoms. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much.